Hello everybody, I'm Frida Stoffer. I have uh, been to the doctor this morning, and I've been to Kroger, and I've been to Aldi, and I've been down the Aldi Isle of Shame, and I have, I picked up one item from the Isle of Shame, and you'll see that if you watch my video. Um, very happy with it. I was so excited to find it. And they had a lot of gorgeous items today, and I'm, uh, I'm happy to see spring and summer items coming up and showing up. And I'm excited about more and more summery items showing up. And anyway, I hope you enjoy my video. Thanks. Hello. <clears throat> oh, look at these beautiful cuties. Oh dear. Oh my goodness. Wow. Gorgeous plants. And they're looking really healthy. That one looks so cute. Oh, wow. <laughs> they're only $8.99 each. That's a very good price. Mm. Very pretty. Gorgeousness. Ivy and ferns and um, I think that's Moses in a boat or a wandering Jew or something. And that is a, a foliage plant. I don't really know its name. Wow, they're so pretty. Okay, so let's see what we can discover this morning. It's not as busy as I expected it would be. Uh, Kroger was really slammed when I went to Kroger earlier, but there's some good uh, German noodles. Ribbon noodles. Mmm. Some Italian things. Oh, are they German or Italian? It could be Italian, I guess. I was thinking of something else, maybe. They have some primavera sauce, vegetable, and um, I guess, oh, what is this? This Italian sausage with peppers. Okay, so some of it has meat in it. What am I going to do here, girls? ladies and oh my look at all this pretty goodness goodness we have some stem glasses some teapots i would take a teapot if they had one that was just simply stainless steel but they do not and i love those uh baking dishes that have a design in the glass i love those and i love this pitcher stoneware pitcher Oh, so pretty. Really, really pretty. I love it. Look how gorgeous. Wow. But what I really want is this. Insulated carafe. I've wanted one for a long time. And I waited to see if Audi would get one. And they finally did. And there's a French press here for coffee. I have never used one. I don't know how but that looks like fun too. I'm not, a, I'm not fixing to get into that yet because I'm happy to find a carafe and I wanted the stainless steel because, oh my, that one has a big dent in it already. Well, um, yeah, I want the stainless steel. There's uh, some painted ones and there's plain ones. I want the plain because the paint will get scratched anyway. Now, I really do love this ceramic pitcher. It's gorgeous. You could use it for a utensil holder or you could use it for beverages. There are some that have dots on them and some that are, that just are more uh, smooth with ridges. And oh my, it's so pretty. I would like the, but I like the ones with dots. I'm not getting any though. They're not on my list for today, even though they're gorgeous. And there's a Lazy Susan, $16.99. Some candles, ceramic candles. 
$6.99. I have so many candles I need to burn before I buy more. And I have a golden candle with clock. I guess it's called clock, I'm not sure. There's candles inside. They're winter scents. Wintry Sky, Apple Cinnamon. Uh, Gilded Champagne. Um, and this is a stool here. I saw that on. I was thinking what fun that would be. But I'm not, uh, that's more than I will have in my budget right now. $40 for a wooden stool. Cute and solid as it is. It's really solid. I think I, it would probably hold my weight. Well, no. It says holds up to 225 pounds. So I'm a little over that, but I wouldn't stand on it. It's not uh, big enough for two feet, I don't think. There's a good organization bins for the kitchen or the home. Some heated plush throws. Um, some heaters. Always need heaters when it's cold. It's cold again today. Um, some good air fresheners, aromatherapy, and wax melts are always great. More heaters, little ceramic ones, tiny ones, um, humidifiers. That's a pretty, pretty good price for a humidifier, I think. And it looks like a pretty large one. Although these are warm mist. I, I don't like warm mist ones, I like cool mist. And there's a mini cool mist humidifier. It's rechargeable. And I guess it would be like for one person to have beside your bed or something on your bed table, just next to your nose. <laughs> there's a heart and tail item, pet. Pet boots? Oh, they are little pet boots. <laughs> Why are there, are there four? Yes, there's four in a little bag. How cute. Little pet beds. Cuddle Crew Jr. has a children's Cuddle Crew um, oversized blanket hoodies. That's cute for smaller kids. Some bath soak. They have Serenity with rose oil. They have Relax with lavender oil. And they have bath soak with eucalyptus oil. The eucalyptus oil is the one I'm scared of because one time when I was sick with uh, bronchitis, I tried to um, use some eucalyptus oil and I immediately wasn't able to, I immediately, my throat closed and I had to go to the hospital because I couldn't breathe. <clears throat> so I'm afraid of eucalyptus oil. I'm thinking I might have an allergy to that. But as far as I know, the lavender and the rose are both scents I can handle. And I would go with the rose because I'm not a big fan of lavender either but they have pretty scents. I would definitely like the rose. And there's a face, fresh face cloth for washing your face. Nice. For makeup, removing your makeup. Yeah, okay. Some boots. That's a good price for boots. Mm, some rugs, bath rug sets. curtains. I like, I, I was thinking of one of these, but I decided I uh, am not going to get that today because I want the care of the most. Um, is it a care of? Yes, it's a care of. Industrial care of. Okay. There is a weighted vest. 12 pound weighted vest. Really? and a fitness weight set. Those are for fitness. You wear those to exercise, to get strong. <laughs> and there's some stretch and tone bars. Everything you need to get toned and fit. And here's one of those adjustable step decks. Well, those are useful for anybody who's young and energetic. And then there's a fitness mat. 
I always like fitness mats to do yoga. I haven't done yoga in years. Master hardware. Oh, that's like a Swiss Army knife. Almost missed it. <laughs> Has all the hand tools in it. There's two different ones. That would be a nice. Uh, those would be a good thing to collect for stocking stuffers next uh, winter. Yeah, for any person in your life who, who needs uh, multitasking tools. Socks. Everybody needs socks all the time. Socks get lost. They walk away <laughs> on their own with no feet in them. <laughs> And they have some spring bulbs here. I thought about it and I decided against it for today because I really want the carrot. So this is not on my list for today. I want the carrot. And this corner tool holder is nice for uh, any any place you could think of. You could put it in, in a shop, in a tool shed, or you could put it and use it as garden tool, for garden tools in a garden tool shed or you know in my sunroom or uh, in the kitchen for brooms and things I think I believe that would work too <clears throat> could use it for anything like that and the mops and buckets are here oh they still have these beautiful heavy tables here that you use to raise your computer up if, if you're working on a regular table you just put that up there for your monitor and then you can put your keyboard under it that way you don't have to spend big money for a large and, and a computer desk because you can just use a regular table and I think that is really cool and they still have some of these mosaic uh, solar lanterns which I love the green one is my favorite really like it I wish they had a one with blue teal and blue and uh, turquoise and maybe gold I think that would be so pretty um, but the green one is my favorite of these two there's one back there with red and orange and all those colors and the green is so lovely it was already here last week um, yeah and there's some a, a lovely sign I like to take a picture of it every week because that way you can know <coughs> I'm in the Isle of Shame, the Audi Finds Isle, where we we get to brag for the things we find, even though it's uh, <clears throat> not a essential item. And uh, work zone mats, all-purpose mats, and they still have those little personal tables. That I saw that I saw last week. Now this side is going to be mostly things from last week, but even though I think that I don't, I'm not that interested in it. I'll go slow. So, in case some of you have not seen it before, there's the um, still some of the little fox baskets, and now they're half price, seventeen fifty. Down here on Summer Avenue, if anybody is interested, um, for a nursery or a kid's uh, toy basket or something. Cute. Still have those lovely cushions, pillows, accent pillows. And we still have some of those toy uh, cleaning sets for kiddos. Boots, socks, hats. <laughs> and we still have the um, fire extinguishers and a smoke alarm. Watches for kids. Toys. I don't want to look too long at the toys. <laughs> My daughter would. She likes Raya. She's watched that movie over and over. And now she's in. She's been into uh, that other Spanish one. I forgot. Mm, I forgot the name of it. But she sings the song. Let's talk about Bruno. Oh, day long. Alexa. She nearly wore out Alexa asking for that song. <laughs> Um, and then there's some two pound bags of different colors of uh, kinetic sand. There's purple, green, blue, and pink. Oh, my daughter would be so excited if she saw that. She loves kinetic sand. 
<laughs> Thankfully to me, she's nearly outgrown the slime phase. <laughs> she ruined a lot of clothes with slime. But she still likes kinetic sand. And there's some containers. They're beautiful and lovely. And there's some other ones that are made of like, uh, I don't know what they're made of, but it looks like some kind of grass. Different ones. I'm a, I'm a fan of the ceramic ones. I'm not a big fan of the grassy ones, but some people are. And they still have some of these uh, clean sensation, clean sensations, older plasters that you put in your laundry. Um, <clears throat> they still have some grow lights. They were here last week. And they have uh, planners, four piece pajama sets, slippers, first slides, mm, socks for ladies and gentlemen. T-shirts, boots. I'm waiting for a hose. I want a new hose this year. My garden. I hope they get hoses. Maybe next week. <laughs> Some pajamas. Cute, cute pajamas. Ladies dusters. Oh, those are pull-on pants. They're not pajamas. Why did that look like a pajama to me? Oh, it's a sweatshirt dress. Oh yeah, I saw some of those on the on the um, Audi Isle of Shame uh, community page on Facebook. The ladies were buying them and wearing them and modeling them. They're adorable and cozy for this weather. So chilly outside today. Um, the dusters are so cute too. <laughs> Different colors, and and the fabric is lightweight but still warm for a, like a spring day that's still a little chilly yeah and here's here's one that's just solid light gray silver gray and this one i i like both i like the silver gray and i like the three color four color one it was so pretty um we still have some of the stock pots they had a few weeks ago and the bath sets still baths have a bath set and a ring cushion to sit on or making traveling easier over the door hooks and they still have some of these to go containers <clears throat> they're so cute so cute <laughs> well I have so many uh, container type things at home although these are very good quality I think that they're, they're awesome quality they still have some of the stretch pods um, oh, and there's, they still have some of those old cool mist humidifiers with the, with the um, fake uh, succulents in, in the top of it. One lady uh, on the um, Audi Isle of Shame um, community page on Facebook had uh, showed where she bought some, one and she wanted more succulents in it. So she went to Dollar Tree and bought some and she put... Uh, glued them in with hot glue so she had a more it was fuller so that's one idea that you can do with that if you'd like more Just still have a ceramic cap tower heater here and one sewing machine I don't see a price for the sewing machine shower heads the giant shower heads are still here and that little cool mist humidifier personal I like these things because as a person with uh, respiratory disease, the idea that I could get a cool mist one uh, in, in a small size makes me happy. And you just put a water bottle on it like that. And it doesn't come with a tank. And I think that's amazing, an amazing, amazing thing to have if you have respiratory disease and you need a cool mist sometimes to help you breathe. And there's a <clears throat> mega bakeware down there. A giant bait where that was here a few weeks ago and I still like it but I still don't think I need that big of a size it's perfect if you cater or or something but average people don't really need it even if you have six to four children or six children or something okay so this is 
the end of this aisle, I think. Let me go around the side and see what else there is. <laughs> I showed all of you last week. They're still, they still have a few. I still have them. I still love them, but I still have a closet full. <laughs> so I don't need any, even though these are awesome. Very, very awesome. There's a gnome. Hoodies. Some feather soft rolls. I love these dudes. They are so soft and cozy. And the price is only $14.99 and they are so fluffy. But they are bad for asthma because they they can they retain dust. Big fluffy things like this, big fuzzy stuff, just uh, keeps so much dust inside. So I try not to get the big thick ones. I like lighter weight ones. They're just as warm and can be just as soft. But of course, there's always some extra pleasure in having this big thick fluffy thing. Anyway, those are sofa covers, which uh, I um, they look like nice, but I don't know. I, I've never tried one. I don't have. Don't know anyone who has. More mop sets. I still have some of these Cuban sandwich and Nashville hot kettle cooked chips. Bob 
Ravens buffalo macaroni and cheese. That looks good. And then there's some Budweiser pulled pork if you like pork. <laughs> but my kids would like this buffalo macaroni and cheese. It says it's mild, but it must have buffalo sauce in it. Okay, I will try to show you anything new that's here in the freezer but I'm not I'm gonna skip the stuff that's not new this is a blueberry mascarpone torte that looks really good $6.99 um, and there's a double chocolate one and there's a lemon one I think those are Italian because it's mascarpone mascarpone is Italian too cream cheese and then we have oh uh, wait we still have these um, my kids tried these and they really like them uh, hash brown sticks I think I'll get one more if my kids are fans and then they have veal patties breaded veal patties Mio is a baby calf. We have a little calf. So, let's see. Anything else new here? Oh, some cheese sticks. Mozzarella sticks, yes. But my kids are not fans of those. And there's donut bars. Donut bars flavored ice cream. <laughs> okay, that looks like fun. I think the kids would like that. There's two different ones. There's strawberry and there's vanilla and chocolate. I think the kids would like that. There's some Italian winter ice cream, winter Italian ice cream cups. Different flavors to choose from. They look so yummy. Uh, $3.79 for what two and they're in a cute shape cute shape cup that's kind of romantic they're having dinner for two there's a crispy pan pizza uh, one pepperoni one cheese in the pack so if you don't eat pepperoni then you don't want that and there's some screaming Sicilian ones these are mother of meat, so that means they're meaty, and a lot of people don't want these, but if sometimes they have cheese ones, and we like those, but these are mother of meat ones, so I'm sure we don't like them. <laughs> we don't want them. All right. I think that's the last new item I see in the frozen bunkers. Okay. I'm going to put this carafe, beautiful stainless steel carafe that I got from Audi right now. I'm going to put it here in the cabinet where I put my coffee and tea items, everything that has to do with coffee and tea. I love coffee and tea, so I'm putting all the coffee tea stuff in here, in this cabinet with, with my peacocks. <laughs> and I'm putting that one in there until I get a coffee dripper in which I can actually use it to store my dripped coffee.